there is an epidemic of insecurity in our society today. Many people suffer from an unhealthy need for approval and affirmation from others. For some, it can become an addiction. This addiction can be very serious, and we have to continually addict it to uh, get this approval of others. Otherwise, we don't feel anything good about ourselves. In today's passage, we've learned that we need to have a healthy dose of the fear of God rather than men. Three things I've learned. The first thing is the fear of men is a snare. Anna and Sapphira saw how generous Barnabas was and respect that was given to him. They want to have the same respect from others as well. So what did they do? They sold the land, kept some of the money, but implied to the others that they have sacrificially gave everything. What they have done is not only hypocrisy, but they show contempt for God. Second, Peter approached them and confronted them. Peter, with the gift of the Holy Spirit, of the gift of knowledge, confronted them and telling them that they could have sold land and kept the money and do whatever they want with the money. But they cannot use this for the spiritual pride and to lie to God. And Peter said to them, because of that, God's judgment is on you. Then God's judgment fell, and both of them died separately. The great fear of God fell to the whole church. The third thing is, the fear of God spread to the whole city. After as Anna and Sapphira died, the church was filled with fear. The fear of not of just God, but how serious uh, following Jesus is all about. There's an, an impeccable integrity that uh, people outside knows about the people of the church. And people tends to come and uh, follow Jesus. This brings great revival to the city for the people fear God because they know that he is real and serious. My application is, there is a addictive of addiction of approval for others in our society, which is fueled by social security today. We need to break this. We need to fear God instead. So what should we do? We need to know the Bible. The Bible tells us the fear of men is a snare because it can be an idol in our life. We need to fear God instead. And we need to know his word each day, know about his character and treat God as he should be. We need to love God and we need to have live our lives as the with our intention of the audience of just one person who is God and not audience of many people. My prayer today is, Father, we are, I'm sorry that I've been a hypocrite and uh, we seek approval for others. Help me to break this approval and help me to trust in you and fear God and you alone. Help me to serve you as who you should be. In Jesus' name I pray. Amen.